Hi gang, I wanted to talk to you about a little trial that we've got here where we're using weeds, we're weaponizing weeds to work in favor of natives. Now as you can see all around me is basically weeds and in fact only six months ago this place had been brush cut down. I gave it, it was fully weed infested, we gave it a big haircut, got everything down, we didn't kill it. What we wanted to do was to let them get down so that we could plant stuff it was only this big of melaleucas the theory being that these guys would create a microclimate they would create competition they'd create humidity and they'd make good growing conditions for the melaleucas instead of knocking it all down spraying it all and then just planting it out in its traditional fashion six months later the result well here's the result this is one of those melaleucas that was only that tall when it went in the ground it's now close to six foot. And in fact, when we look around here, here's another one that's probably at about four feet tall, another one of similar height. We've got one over here. We've got one through here. Uh, there's another plant there. More here and more here. So what we're doing in effect is using weeds to actually be the friend of the native plant to not go through and drench the place in herbicide come back in three months and do it again but rather to use these sun loving weeds to create the perfect growing conditions for these plants to thrive it's working a treat now over time these guys will get up to being about 60 feet tall they'll have a big spread on them though their, their leaves and, and branches will be touching each other and all of these sun loving weeds will simply get competed out. So the end result here is that it uses hardly any herbicide whatsoever. In fact, you can you get away with using zero. It's very, very cost effective because you only get in and whack these guys once and knock them down, plant, water them for only three weeks, get them established, and then let nature take its course. I'm really stoked. This is the way of the future. Cheers. Mwah.